Welcome to the fourth edition of Big Tractor Power News, where you receive updates on what Big Tractor Power is currently filming out in the field, a preview of upcoming videos to the Big Tractor Power YouTube channel, and information on our next live stream. Big Tractor Power has been busy out in the field filming the 2018 forge harvesting season. One of the coolest things that I've come across so far is what you're seeing right now, a John Deere 9330 four-wheel drive tractor, chopping corn with a New Holland Forge Harvester and a United Farm Tools dump wagon. And that will be a video coming up on the channel in the near future. Let's take a look at other videos that are on the way. Big Tractor Power has a new video series called John Deere Farm Machines Making Cow Chow. It's a four-part series with episode number one already posted to the channel featuring John Deere forage harvesters processing corn into silage that will be fed to dairy cows. And we're going to follow the entire process in the four-part series of how the silage is chopped and stored back at the farm and we'll head up to the dairy barn to see it actually being fed out to the cows. In addition to these machines, there are other John Deere machines to look forward to in the Cow Chow series. In western Kentucky, where this was filmed, sorghum is double crop behind the forge harvester, so we'll see John Deere sprayers, large tractors working up the ground behind the choppers with John Deere 915 V rippers. These loosen the soil from all the compaction from the forge harvester, the wagons and the tractors working their way across the field to clear the corn off. And then we'll see a corn planter coming along and planting that second crop of sorghum. So there's lots of stuff to look forward in this new four-part series called John Deere Farm Machines Making Cow Chow. There are also additional forage harvesting videos on Big Tractor Power YouTube that have already been posted. One of the coolest was these three crone Big X forage harvesters working side by side in the field. So I hope that you'll check all these new videos out on the channel. There are several new farm machine videos on the way to Big Tractor Power YouTube, and I want to give you a preview of what's coming to the channel next. One of the things I like to do is to try to film all brands of farm equipment. And one of the items on my list to film has been a McCormick tractor. And I was able to track down a few during the corn chopping season, including this one pulling a Dion forage harvester and a Richardson dump wagon. This Dion was harvesting four rows of corn at a time. And it was pretty cool to see the McCormick tractor and Dion at work chopping corn. In addition to being out in the field with a McCormick tractor, I was able to catch up with another one at a silage bunk with a dozer blade pushing up corn silage for feed for dairy cows. And you can see over in the right hand corner there is another McCormick tractor with a batwing mower clipping the pasture. For Blue Tractor fans, there is a full feature video on the New Holland TV 6070 tractor on the way. We'll watch this New Holland bi-directional tractor doing some loader work. New Holland bi-directionals were built in Fargo, North Dakota, and we'll see another Fargo-built tractor, a Steiger Cougar 3, plowing up pea ground in Wisconsin in another feature big tractor power YouTube video in the near future. For Agco fans, I have a video on an Alice Chalmers 8070 tractor. This is a very popular orange tractor from the early 1980s and was one of the last Alice Chalmers tractors built before the company became Deutz Alice. Another Agco product on the way is a Massey Ferguson 850 Combine. This Combine has been on the top of my wish list to film for quite a while, and I found a pair in Wisconsin to film harvesting wheat, so stay tuned to see these Massey Combines at work. If you're a Kloss Lexian fan, I have all sorts of footage on the way in September featuring new 2018 Lexian Combines. There are some new features that I was not able to share just yet because they'll be introduced at the Farm Progress Show later in August. And I'm really excited to show you some of these new 2018 Lexian Combines and some new features coming up on those. In addition to the Lexians, I have video footage of the Kloss Quadrant Big Baller. This video will feature the Big Baller churning out 1,000 pound bales across a wheat field here in western Kentucky. It's been an exciting 2018 summer season in western Kentucky following the winter wheat harvest and corn chopping. And now as the summer winds down and late August approaches, it means that combines will be rolling out in the cornfields of western Kentucky and big tractor power will be there to catch all the action. 
Corn is planted in mid-March in western Kentucky and normally takes 100 days to mature, so it means it's time for combines to start moving because the winter wheat crop in western Kentucky is planted right after the corn is harvested. One of the combines I'm really excited to spend some time out in the field with is the new 2018 S700 series. We'll be tracking down the S790, the S780, and the S770, as well as the John Deere 12 row folding corn head. Another machine I'm really excited to get out there and see in corn harvest is the all new Fent Ideal Combine from Agco. Big tractor power fans are invited to a four wheel drive tractor farm day the Wathen Family Farm Day in Evansville, Indiana, on Sunday, August 12th. The event starts at noon, and the farm is located at 3101 Green River Road, Evansville, Indiana. It's located just off the exit of Interstate 69 on Green River Road. You can't miss the farm. It's right there as you get off the interstate. There will be over 50 four-wheel drive tractors on display, a total of 100 tractors in all. There will be family fun with hay rides, food, as well as visitors can drive some of the big tractors. The entire event is free, and I hope to get to see you at this event. If you cannot attend in person, Big Tractor Power will live stream from the farm day at 1 o'clock Central Time on Sunday, August 12th. So make sure to tune in to Big Tractor Power on YouTube if you can't make it and you want to see a walking tour of all the big four-wheel drive tractors at the Wathen Family Farm Day. I hope that you've enjoyed this edition of Big Tractor Power News and the previews of all the videos that are on the way to the channel. It would be great to meet you at the Wathen Family Farm Day this Sunday, August 12th in Evansville, Indiana. Again, if you cannot attend in person, Big Tractor Power YouTube will be live streaming from the event starting at 1 p.m. Central. If you would like to see more videos from Big Tractor Power, consider subscribing to the channel where there are over 1,000 videos of farm equipment in action. If you're already a subscriber, make sure to check the channel's homepage often as new videos are published every two to three days. In fact, new videos are posted on Sundays, Tuesdays and Thursdays and sometimes on Saturdays I like to put an extra bonus video out just showing farm equipment at work out in the field sharing some of the scenes so that you can see and hear the machinery as they're actually working. Also if you would like to get a preview or a sneak peek of what's coming up to the channel check out Big Tractor Power Instagram where I share short videos and pictures of what is currently being filmed in the field. As always thank you for watching. 